December 4th, 2021, off one of the best seasons in program history, the Rams saw their season come to an end against Colorado School of Mines in the NCAA quarterfinals. There's no doubt uh, that loss left a bad taste in your mouth throughout the offseason. In offseason, the Rams look to continue building toward the main goal, a national championship. It was a huge uh, offseason for us in both uh, preparation and in recruiting, and uh, you could see it in spring ball. You could see it all the way through uh, going into the season. A team that lost players like every team does at the end of a season, but the group they had coming back knew they had something special. We didn't lose too many guys on offense and defense, so we, we felt like we'd have a pretty strong team coming into this year. Um, and just guys buying in to you know the process and everybody working together and working hard throughout the summer and offseason. The season would get started with a big home victory against Shadron State and then a rematch with the Ore Diggers who ended their season last year. A statement win early for the Rams as Lone Star Conference play opened up. Coming in starting the year with that, we knew that was going to be a big game. We knew how good they were. We knew how good we were going to be, so it ended up really going well, and we were excited about that win. Just past the halfway point, Angelo State would remain undefeated, setting up a show down with Texas A&M Kingsville and a battle of perfect teams. That game coming in, we knew that was going to be the game to either make us or break us, and uh, that game ended up going really well for us. I mean, that kind of affirmed some of the beliefs we had about our team moving forward. Win after win, seeing their ranking move up to number two, the highest in program history, looking to clinch the outright title at home against Central Washington for the first time since 1984. And when you put in you put in the work that we've put in, and you see it come into fruition, it's it's great. You know, it's a good feeling. With one game left, a lot on the line for the Rams. A perfect season, perfect conference record, and clinching a number one seed for the upcoming NCAA tournament. We knew going into that game that uh, capping off that game with a win would mean a huge bye week for us, which could get everybody healthy. We knew that moving forward, and uh, that was huge. The perfect season, the first since their move to Division II back in 1981, the first outright conference title since 1984, with a group that is hungrier than ever. The staff is a bunch of workers. These guys just, uh, they're not going to be... Uh, you know, happy. They're going to be happy with what we've done, but they're not going to be satisfied with it. And they're going to continue to work hard and and uh, and and keep building on what we're doing. A season filled with goals. Now just one more to cross off. Bring back a national title to San Angelo, the first since 1978 when the Rams were competing in NAIA play. It would mean everything, man. You know, this is what we work for every year, um, all year round. Football is all year round sports, so this is what we work for. This is what we grind for. Blood, sweat, and tears. And it would mean the world, honestly.